Hey, how's it going? Checking in for today. I did make some progress with a couple of the projects that I've got on for January. It felt pretty good actually to be um, this organized, even though I know that I, I have to be, because uh, otherwise I'm gonna get into a, a bit of bit of stuck next month. So, um, but even so, it was still good to have that sort of performance under no pressure, which I've talked about a little bit on these videos before, I think way back in maybe over the summer, July, August time, uh, I try to um, create a false deadline for myself and say, right, I have to get, um, I have to create a new talk by such and such date, six weeks time, or maybe it's just three weeks time. Um, even though I didn't, I knew that I didn't actually have to do that. Um, and it, it was, <laughs> it, well, I said it was a struggle. It didn't actually happen in the end. I think I just glossed over that and just didn't mention it again till now. So there you go. Um, <laughs> a bit of honesty for you there. <laughs> um, and, uh, so yeah, so kind of this feels a little bit, a little bit like that in terms of, um, I don't have to have this done until January yet. I'm here. I am sort of six weeks early, uh, cracking on with it. And even though I, obviously I know that I have to do it, I, I am usually the kind of person who leaves it to the last minute. Um, and I feel like I perform well while I've got that pressure. Um, so I'm just trying to be a little bit more organized with it this time and, um, know that it'll, it'll be a process that will stand me in good stead if I can, if I can pull it out. There are a few things I need to know and actually I'm waiting to hear back from uh, the law firm in TAME to not just confirm the date, I think I've, probably, I think I've got the date down with them, um, but actually I, I want to get in and interview some of the solicitors to, to, to get a, a really good grip on the, the, the nature and the scope of their particular challenges so I can make sure that I, I really guide the the, the program and the content to, um, to something that's really, really valuable and useful to them. It sort of makes sense. I want to be making sure that I'm, I'm, I'm using examples that are, are absolutely 100% relevant. So, uh, I, again, it's a bit like, in fact, <laughs> I was reading an article today um, in uh, some, some online platform on ghosting, which is how you, uh, apparently how you dump somebody uh, that you're not quite gelling with if you're uh, in a romantic relationship and uh, you just don't ever get back to them again. You don't message them. You just ignore any incoming phone calls or emails or, or, or WhatsApp messages. And um, <laughs> to be honest, that's how it feels sometimes. Like, am I, am I being ghosted here? Am I just being ignored? <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, I, I, I keep reminding myself, no, <laughs> It's not, I'm not being ignored. I just got to keep on pushing and I got to keep on sending emails out. And I, as it's only when I get an absolute no, sorry, this ain't going to happen. That's the point where I can um, hold fire with my follow-ups. Um, although this did come to a bit of a head in the uh, spring, I think it was, where I was really, I had so many what I call open loops with these different uh, conversations going on. And um so much of my mental bandwidth was taken up by thinking, all right, who's going to be getting back to me today? Is anybody going to be getting back to me today? Am I going to be um, chasing uh, chasing dead leads all day or week or month or year? Uh, and so in the end, I sort of had to mentally move on from, from, from many of those. And funnily enough, some of them are, have actually come, come back and turned into things. So it certainly didn't do them any harm to do that. And I, I, I'm probably close to to that point with a couple of the, the, the ones I'm waiting to hear back for, from for January. Um, and, uh, but there were a couple that, uh, I have had confirmed, just need to get more details from like this, uh, uh tame law firm. So anyway, it's, it's all good. It's all getting there. As I said, I've, I've made some good progress today with three of the projects, um, that I have coming up in January. The, the one I really got to focus on now is momentum, not just creating the content. I've got some really good ideas for that but um, actually the marketing of it as well. We're at about, I think about 85 tickets or something. We've sold 85 tickets and we want to be sort of 300 plus. I know we'll sell 100 plus, 150 plus in, in the new year, in the first week and a half of January, because that's just what we've always done the last two years. Um, but it's a pain leaving it to that, that, that late. So we're still gonna get a, a good 100 more um, seats sold ideally. Um, in the next three or four weeks. So got to really get a wriggle on with that. So um, that's got to be a bit more of a focus this week. Uh, tomorrow, um, I've got a meeting in the morning uh, to discuss a, oh, this was something else that came back. Um, actually, I'll, I'll talk about this tomorrow because it's a, it's a fairly substantial um, project that's had some progress on. So uh, yeah, there has been some sort of forward 
forward moving. Someone who has come back to me today, <laughs> which kind of uh, contrary to everything else I've just been saying. Um, but uh, so yeah, some progress. I had a meeting in the morning with uh, with somebody with Andy who we're looking at putting something together, um, uh, a, a completely separate piece, more on um, sort of uh, mental resilience and, uh, and and growth mindset thinking rather than pure well being. Although that will be a part of the the thing that we put together. Anyway, more on that tomorrow. Um, once I've got a bit more information, and um, I'll leave that there, and I'll check in again with you tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon. Sorry, bye for now.